arthritis in old patients always will tell you it's like oh it's gonna rain tomorrow and yeah I grew up with my grandfather telling me that all the time and you always think it's like what do they know but they actually pretty accurate um, and there's actually some data behind it um, some of the ideas of why rain or cold weather all those things change the way we feel and help us predict the weather um, has to do with temperature changes in themselves uh, when the temperature gets colder uh, it may affect your nerves, it may affect uh, your muscles, they tend to be stiffer and as you start stiffening up you can feel like well something's happening and as a result patients will, will reflect on that and think that the weather changes uh, which is pretty accurate. Um, temperatures don't just drop in five minutes, they slowly start trending to a lower temperature so that our, our joints have this pretty good sensor per se. Um, the, the rain is another character that is, is on its own. Um, springtime brings rain. Um, with rain usually comes pressure changes. Uh, we think that you know when, when it rains usually the pressure drops significantly which may, may, makes your joint pressure being much higher than the outside. So a couple of things happen with higher pressure is again the nerves get irritated but also increases the swelling inside your joints. So that's what barometers do. They predict pressure changes and that's how they predict the weather. Um, as a result, our knee or the fingers in the, in, in the hand can in themselves be a little barometer that tells people like, hey, pressure changes, it's gonna change the weather, you know, but you should act on it then. Um, it's not just something that, you know, old patients tell you. Uh, it's something that you can take to heart and maybe you should take some medications for it. Um, if the weather changes, it's going to hurt your joints. Be prepared.